Hi, this slide really is kind of a preview of coming attractions. Uh, as much as I hope you've realized the acute, powerful need for having line item profit analytics, you also are saying, but Bruce, you left us hanging. There are lots of things I want to know more, more, more about as far as this LIPA story. And so we'll get to them. Um, in a later section, we'll talk about guidelines for how to design an optimally complex cost to serve model, not too simplistic, not too complicated that crushes under its own weight, but optimal. Um, we'll look at specific cases and plays uh, that we can uh, use to solve uh, or address the root causes of the profit unprofit extremes. Uh, we'll go into more detail on the tracking reports that I alluded to. Uh, we'll talk about how to design a Delta PBIT incentive plan for reps and all employees on a gain sharing basis. Um, we'll use uh, LIPA a lot in the next section as far as customer nicheonomics. Uh, and uh, we're going to want to be able to use it, particularly to go out and renegotiate our losing customers uh, into a win-win kind of thing. And we want to do that from a, this is a very key point, from a best service value strength. If I'm a mediocre competitor with a mediocre service, then I go out and try to push a customer around as far as telling them that they need to buy differently. Uh, obviously, I'm going to try to be a diplomat and I'd insult their intelligence, that, you know, that they're obsessively focused on one part of the total elephant. Uh, but uh, it still would be better if I could go out and have the, the, the credibility and the perceived value of being, you know, somebody they couldn't really do without because our service was so, so distinctively good and it, it helped whatever aspects of supply chain they can see, not they're seeing all of them. Um, and it would certainly help if with any of these customers that we could go out there and ask for, deserve, get last look at a point or two more for a business in the transactional uh, bid, bark, and buy box. But the key thing is, is that is the, our ticket. We need to sort of say, look, let's get out of this game. And if we're going to get out of this game and get married to create real win-win economics, you know, I'm the one with the service excellence that you can afford to marry. Everybody else is a flake. You wouldn't want to marry a service flake. So we'll see in the next section on customer economics more reasons for LIPA, and then after that, we'll get into the, the nitty-gritty of, of, of the stuff above here on this slide. Thank you very much.